Hi, Superstruce here, back from another answer to mention new game minus 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 video, episode 27, and I have E27 infinity points, same, like the exponents, the same the episode here, and I can get some upgrades. So, first of these is dimension cost multiplier increase goes from 5 times to 4 times. That'll be huge. That'll allow me to get a lot more galaxies and all that. I can also get an infinity point doubler, and I think I can get, I can actually, I can get two of these infinity dimension things. So, that may, that may help things. Like, let's see. I can... I'm already up to 52 galaxies, and this is super easy. Like, look at this. 55, 56 galaxies. And actually, it's getting two tick speed boosts. Like, like two of these tick speed boosts. That, that's how I'm getting all that. And it looks like I can actually get all the way up to 57 galaxies, allowing me to get almost E27 affinity points here. I don't think it's worth it to try to wait until... I can get 58 galaxies here, but you can just see E27 infinity points. That'll allow me to, again, double my infinity points, and yeah, it's going to be pretty overpowered because now I can probably at least make it up to, like, 55 galaxies. So, 54 and 55 galaxies. Maybe I can get 56, hopefully, um, and I could wait for 56. I'm not sure if it's... I think it is a good idea to try to wait for 56, because then I'll get me a lot more infinity points. And that'll allow me to buy some more upgrades. So there's an upgrade here. It's further increase all dimension multipliers, which is, it goes from X to 1.48 to X to 1.5. It's only a little past E27 infinity points. There's also, this is E27. And here is the 56th galaxy. So hopefully that'll actually increase my infinity points for a minute. Actually, it does not. So it looks like I only want to go up to 55 galaxies. I also probably want to increase these numbers. It's so like, for example, I think 45 and 320 will work. And then 35 and, let's say, 250. Let's see if that works. Hopefully it will. So, yeah, let's see. Oh, I can only get 33 galaxies. So, 33 galaxies. And it doesn't even look like I can get... Okay, I, I should probably make this 240 instead of 250. And I can only get 44 galaxies. And, and I can only, can't quite get 320. So maybe I can do 44 and 290. So now what I can do is I can use this to try to get the best infinity points per minute possible here. So let's see, 48 galaxies, 49, 50, 51. Now I'm pressing D and getting tick speed boosts to try to speed up further. And at 55 galaxies, this, this will allow me to get two E26 infinity points per minute, which will give me one point, or a little over one E26 per minute offline, which is really good. That's going to definitely allow me to get this upgrade very soon and this infinity dimension thing. And hopefully, actually within a day, I'm going to be able to get this E29 upgrade and this E30 upgrade. I think is going to be overpowered. So, yeah, seen a bit. Okay, I'm back like a day later, and I have 1.4 E29 infinity points. This is going to allow me to get a bunch of stuff. Like, I'm not sure if I should get this, because there are some other upgrades I can get, like the infinity point doublers. I think I should get anything under E29, so I should get one of these, and then I should also get this. And let's see how, how much this is going to push me to. So, 58 galaxies. Can I get 59? Is 59 possible? N n I don't think so. I'm, I'm close, but I don't think it's quite possible. I could try to get this upgrade, or I could just get the doubler. I'm not really sure which one is better. There's also an E29 upgrade here, but that's... I should not get that. I should get, I should get this before I get that. I feel like I just want to go for the doubler. I know it's like the more boring option, but that's what I'm going to do. And I'm already like 62% of the way to E29 again. So I think this is the right option. And let's see how quick I can actually actually go here. So I can, I can get 56 galaxies, and that gives me E22, E27 infinity points per minute. So that's pretty good. I sort of wish it could be a little bit faster, but... It, it, it'll allow me to reach, I, I, I would say, it'll allow me to reach 
E29 in about half an hour, which is really not bad. So, yeah, seen a bit. Okay, so it's been about a half hour, and I finally have E29 Infinity Points, which allows me to get this last upgrade here. So this should make the Infinity Dimensions a lot cheaper. Yeah, you can see there's two E26 here, and then there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of these I can get. So I feel like that's pretty powerful. That's I already have 58 galaxies, and I wonder if 59 is possible. Uh, no, 59 is not possible. Unfortunately, I, I, I can I can dream, but whatever. I, at, at least this is going to speed things up even further, though. Like, I'm, I'm going to get more infinity points per minute, which will allow me to get... There's this inf break infinity upgrade that's 2E30 infinity points that I feel like it's going to be overpowered. Maybe I can even get 57 galaxies right off the bat here. Let's see. Yeah, there's 57, so that's going to definitely speed things up. I can get... About 1 E28 infinity points per minute, allow me to get 5 E27 per minute. So that'll definitely allow me to reach 2 E30 in just a couple hours. And this is going to this is gonna, this is gonna be pretty overpowered because essentially it's going to allow me to get a lot more galaxies. And you know how powerful the galaxies are. So, yeah, seen a bit. Okay, I'm back a day later, yes, I, I know it's a day later, even though I could have gotten it in just a few hours. But anyway, I can get E30 infinity points to double this, but more importantly, I can get this upgrade. It's going to make the dimension cost multiplier increase only three times. It's going to allow me to get a lot more galaxies, galaxies. I can also get this upgrade, and maybe even some infinity dimensions. Yes, I can. Actually, I can get quite a few of these. It looks like I can get three, which will definitely help things. So let's see how many galaxies I can get. I can already get 65 right off the bat, which is huge. This is going to allow me to reach E31 infinity points, and I'm, I think, can I get 69? Uh, no, not quite. Unfortunately, 69 is a little bit out of reach, but the thing is that I can get E32 infinity points. This is going to allow me to get not one, but two infinity point doublers, which is huge. I'm also probably going to be, I'm not sure if I can get 68 galaxies like before, but I I think at least I'll be able to get 67, and that'll allow me to get probably almost E32 infinity points, if not E32. So let's see, 66 galaxies, 67 may be out of reach, unfortunately, but it's still going to give me two E31 infinity points. Just one more of these infinities will, uh, will allow me to get, actually I can already get this, allowing me to buff the infinity dimensions even more. Maybe I can even try to go for some achievements now, because things are so much faster than before. Like, I'm feeling like maybe I should try to lower challenge times. I'm not sure. I Maybe I can, I can lower them. I could try to go for a 67th galaxy here. It's only about 20 orders of magnitude, so I think I'm just going to wait for this, and I'll look at my challenge times while I'm waiting. So, challenge records. The Actually, the slowest one is, is one second, which is really good. So I don't even think that's going to have an effect. Maybe I should try to go for error 909. I don't think that's quite possible yet. So also I got the 67th galaxy here. So this will, this will allow me to reach almost 5 E31 infinity points. Doesn't look like we can get much more than that. But at least there's an upgrade here in break infinity that is about E33. So... It's, this is definitely a good speed boost, and it's like the only time where New Game Minus 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 is going to actually feel fast. And I, I'm trying, seeing if maybe 67 Galaxies can give me a best infinity points per minute here. Let's, let's see, if I just wait a little bit. Yeah, I don't think Error 909 is possible at this point. Okay, here we go. 67 galaxies. This gets me all the way up to uh, not. It's just not. It's not quite. Okay, I'll just get 66 galaxies like normal. Or maybe, maybe what I can do here is, I feel like I can get up to like 40, and 300, and then I can do 50, and 350. I wonder if that works. I'm not sure if that works, but it may work. So let's see. 40 gal. Um, 40 galaxies actually doesn't look like I can get 40. I can get 39. And then, I don't think I can get... Okay, I can't quite get 300. Okay, 39, 290. How about that? That's 
that that may work a little better. Also, I clicked the big crunch button. It didn't even crunch for some reason. Anyway, 39 galaxies, I can get this, and I can get up to 50. Okay, so it looks like I can get the dimension boost, which will speed things up a little bit. So let, let, let's see how how fast I can make this. Let's see, only 4E31. I thought I thought I could get more than that. Actually, I think there is 6E31 per minute. Yeah, 6E31. This will allow me to reach E33 infinity points in again just a half hour. And I'm still pretty far away from the next infinity challenge, but I'll get there eventually. So yeah, see you in a bit. Okay, I'm back like uh, maybe 10 hours later or something like that. And let's see how many galaxies I can get here. 67, maybe I can actually I can get this infinity point doubler. And 68, and come on, here it is. Am I going to get it? Yes, 69 galaxies. Nice. But anyway, there's other things I can get as well. For example, I can get this increase all dimension multipliers, and I can get some, I can get just one infinity dimension thing. Uh, okay, that's not, that's not going to help all that much, but maybe it'll do something. Like, especially if I, here's 70 galaxies. So maybe all of this will help. I'm not quite that close to E8140 antimatter, so I'm a little nervous about that, but I can get E34 infinity points. So at, at least I can get that. The thing is that there's not really much to go for anymore. There's, this is just very far away. The next galaxy is 38th dimensions away, and it's, it, I feel like it's going to be more than one of these upgrades here. And I, there's the infinity dimension. Actually, I can get it right here, which is interesting. So it, it was just a rounding thing. But other than that, there's really not much I can do. And these infinity dimension boosts are very weak. So I'm not really sure what to do. I'm going to hit another wall. I, I don't think there's many achievements I can really get. Like, these just come naturally. And I don't think I can get error 909. And its reward isn't even that good as well. And some of these are just impossible to even get. So I'm really not sure what I should do. I, f I feel like I should, I should try to go for more infinity points here, especially like maybe I can get, yeah, more tick speed boosts here that allow me to get more dimension boosts. And that'll give me ever so slightly more infinity points and I don't think I, I'm okay, I'm making a big deal out of this, but whatever. I, I'm, I'm still gonna do it, just to get a, any anything I can here, and that gets me up to 1.4 E34 infinity points. This will allow me to get let, let's see how many infinity points per minute it's gonna get. I'm gonna be able to get from this. So I think I can go probably up to about 68 galaxies. That's that's what I'm thinking. 64, 65. 66, okay, maybe not 68. I feel like I can get 67, there's 67. And if I just max everything here, that will allow me to get eight E32 infinity points per minute. So it's at least gonna do something. If it's four E32 per minute, it's gonna allow me, it's actually not that good. It's gonna allow me to get E35 infinity points in like a day, actually about like six E35, so E36 is definitely possible, but there's not really much else to do. This is actually a little better. That was like 9 E30, 32 per minute. So I'm really not sure what I can do. I think I may just, I may just do this tomorrow after getting like this E35 upgrade. And then I'll just do that off camera because there's really no boost from that, from, from like this run to that. And then also I'll probably do that again for E36 infinity points. So, yeah. It's really not much there there's not much to do. I I really wish this was just closer. Like this is only like E7500 antimatter. But whatever. Hope you enjoyed. Peace out.